We are all over these markets for you this afternoon, giving you the advice and the guidance that you need to help navigate this sell-off. Leading us off will be Payne Capital Senior Wealth Advisor Courtney Dominguez. Uh, Courtney, last time you were here, you were you were mostly upbeat about this, you know, being perhaps transitory, mm -hmm. uh, which is essentially what David's saying. But that transitory period is like hell. <laughs> okay, it's yes, like it's not it's easy. Not, <laughs> right, it's not an easy period, yeah. particularly for people who aren't really who haven't been through the ups and downs. Uh, you know, we've had a ten-year economic re expansion, and even though. Uh, even last year, we had two periods where the market pulled back 5%. And on average, you get three of those every year. Uh, a, a lot of people have taken it for granted that the market essentially goes straight up. How do you, how, how, first of all, are you still as optimistic as you were? And what do you say to people who may think this is it, it's not worth it? I am optimistic. And I think that's something we're talking to a lot of our clients about right now is when you look at the virus, the consensus is, yes, it will have an uh, economic impact, but this is getting measured in weeks or quarters. We're not talking about years or decades. And so if you're an investor who's a long-term investor, you need to look at this and say, yes, the markets are hit, getting hit hard, but it's a wonderful buying opportunity. So it's a great time to say, do I have any in cash? Do I have any in bonds? Can I be taking advantage of this? And that's really the conversation we're trying to have. When you see utter panic, and quite frankly, the other day when we saw the VIX shoot into the 30s, when the market, the bottom fell out of the market, um, we were getting so many calls and so forth, that could be a sign that the bottom is close. But I would urge everyone out there, don't try and call a bottom in real time. We only see it in hindsight. Right. And does, when do you think the coast is clear, Courtney? Yeah, I mean, I have to agree with that. And I think what's actually really interesting right now is if you look at today, China was actually holding up a lot better than other um, a lot of other parts yeah. of the world, which is fascinating because they got hit so hard and eventually you're going to see prices are going down so much and people are going to uh, scoop back in. That, I think, is actually probably a positive.